We're at the Toyota Grand Prix of Long Beach with Dale Coyne Racing Team members Sebastian Bourdais and Ed Jones. And we're going to ask them a few questions before they hit the Pinewood Derby track right over here. So first of all, Ed, how many times has Sebastian won the race here in Long Beach? I'm going to have to take a bit of a guess here, but I'd say uh, twice. Twice? Eh. <laughs> He's not very good with his stats, so... We had, one, yeah, we had one at the beginning of the year for IndyCar, and I think I got every single one wrong. <laughs> all right. It's all right, no offense taken. The Cub Scout Adventure Program and Boy Scout Merit Badge Program allow the youth to explore their personal interests and potentially build career aspirations. What inspired you to... Oh, wait, oh, sorry. What experience did you draw on it, on as a kid that made you want to pursue a career as a racer? Uh, well, you know, for me it was one of those where uh, really I just grew up on the racetrack. My dad was racing and uh, I got a motorcycle I was three years old. And so after that really anything which was motorized was fun and uh, started to go car. I was 10, started to go pretty well. And, you know, went singing this to the next and before I knew it, it was my job, so it was pretty cool. Very cool. Sebastian, who, which is older, Ed or Forrest Gump? Ed or Forrest Gump? Or the movie Forrest Gump? Ooh, uh, prob probably the movie. You're right. Yeah. yeah. Scouting provides a wide variety of opportunities to the youth in the outdoors. How would you describe your ideal outdoor outing? My ideal outdoor outing right now, uh, there is two. Probably, uh, first one is taking the boat with the kids and going to a little island, uh, kind of having a, a pretty nice Sunday. And uh, we we try to take uh, the coach every now and then and uh, go camping with them and you know just visit. And it's a lot to do in Florida as well, especially during the winter. So it's uh, we just try to go you know in parks and discover stuff, animals and wildlife and nature. A lot of what you do. I, go, I like camping. Camping's really fun. <laughs> okay, we have one question here for Ed. So the scouting program is all about working together as a team. How does your team help you before, during, and after the race? Yeah, with the racing, uh, people don't realize how much uh, how much importance the team makes. You know, you're working with them all the time. They're there working so many more hours than, than us drivers, really, in the background. The mechanics are there at the workshop pretty much every day in the week, trying to prepare the cars as much as possible. And, Get you have a have a reliable car and um, have the engineers trying to give you the fastest cars possible. So the team is very important. If you have a good team around you, you're going to perform really well. And um, I have the Dale Coin and Boy Scouts uh, team on my car, which gives me the perfect opportunity to perform at every race. The end of the Boy Scout oath is: I will do my best to be physically strong, mentally awake, and morally straight. How do these th three characteristics play into your identity as a racer? I think it fits right in, you know. We gotta be, uh, you gotta be really dedicated and focused, and get the job done. And uh, it, there's not much room for error in racing, so it's. Uh, I think it's it's life lessons that you guys have that you know serves into a lot of purposes and definitely into our sport. No, I totally agree with that. You know, there's so many aspects of racing, and the problem with racing is track time is very limited. So all the, the fitness and mental side are so important that you've got to build those up before you get to the track in order to perform quickly and uh, make time, make use of time as much as possible. Okay, I have one question for you, Sebastian. A little fun one. Who won the 2015 Indy Lights race here in Long Beach? I don't know, I'm going to give my teammates some credit for that. I'm not sure he won it, but he won a few, so, you, won a you few? know. You want to answer one? Yeah, that was me. Good guess. Good guess, good job. What part of Boy Scout law best describes your teammate? Trustworthy, loyal, helpful, friendly, friendly, courteous, kind, obedient, cheerful, thrifty, and brave? You know, I haven't known Ed for very, very long, so it's tough to, you know, give descriptions, but I'll, I'll go with, he's a good kid. How about that? All right, are you guys ready to race? Sure. Yeah. Right. Let's go. All right.